And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. Here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Neymar starts with Lionel Messi in the wide midfield positions. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. Starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. David Alaba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the main goal scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned Club Kings of Europe. Not a good pass. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. But quick thinking defensively. Hazard. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Promising attack, but his timing was off. Idrissa Gay. Lionel Messi. Messi. Can they forge ahead? Touched onto the woodwork. No nonsense clearance. Well, that ball looks promising so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here Nacho Fernandez now Casemiro great pressure to win the ball back Luka Modric really good challenge Messi Messi and the cross is very much on and he takes on the shot tremendous reflexes Thibaut Courtois Casemiro now Casemiro this is Kroos Casemiro Tony Kroos now Casemiro and return to Casemiro doing well to keep possession 
Modric. Interception to snuff out the danger. Textbook closing down. And now they're on the attack. Wijnaldum. Messi. There's a slide draw pass. And a goal! It's from Paris Saint-Germain. The first goal of this Champions League final. Incredible scenes. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Pointer to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? Physically strong and secure on the ball. A very good tackle. PSG, as you can see, have not enjoyed that much possession. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Simple for the keeper. Bale, Bale, and teammates to play it to, Casemiro, surely the equaliser, well what a stop that was, And there's the delivery. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Lionel Messi. Messi. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Benzema. Bale. Pulls it back. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Still not clear. Well, last line of defence, literally. They've got it now, what can they do? Alaba, from a textbook interception. Well, PSG could get in behind the defence. Lionel Messi is positioned at the back post. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Tony Kroos Aidan Azar This is Kroos Casemiro Moving the ball effectively Modric Azar on the ball Mbappe Wijnaldum now with Hakimi. Mbappe. 
tremendous reflexes, Thibaut Courtois. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. It's Neymar's corner. A deft clearance. Lionel Messi. Able to get a body in the way. Well, Real Madrid have certainly dominated the ball, as you can see. But they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. He has time to play it over. And a goal kick will be next. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Marco Verratti in the middle. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, but the finish is far too easy. He doesn't even have to jump. How has he afforded that much space? It's a tidy header, but really poor defending. Now the ball is rolling once more. PSG dominant, and it's starting to get out of hand, you just feel. Nacho Fernandez. Just 15 minutes remaining. Karim Benzema. Lucas Vasquez. And he could really get at the opposition. That's how to rob them of possession. And space to cross it. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Substitution for Real Madrid. Hakimi. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Options in the middle. Lionel Messi. Effective challenge. We're inside the final five minutes. My goodness, this has not been close at all. Oh, in with a chance! And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. And it's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. Idrissa Gay, Hakimi, Wijnaldum now, Marquinhos, and we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here, and intercepts again. Vinicius Junior, oh, managing to beat him. And pride shines through. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, 
Well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this.